Oh, I'm live. Okay. Alright. Dubs. Oh, I should mute that. Actually, I should turn it off. Okay. Blocky hockey. I'm staring at a wall. JK. Okay. Hello, I'm Papri Sun. Today we're gonna watch the. No, no. Oh, shit. We're gonna. Oh, I'm sorry. We're gonna watch the Huskies versus the Otters, guys. Oscar. Uh, Oscar. Otters have a very interesting team here. They've been probably one of the few teams this JVHL season to have, like, a lot of big save there by. I think that's annoyed. Uh, as I was saying, Otters having multiple changes to their roster throughout the season, while the. Huskies have been relatively the same. Shot there from Nick Master, who comes in starting alongside Trevor Zegras, who I've seen not much of, I will be completely honest. Big pass there from the Huskies, who which lets Nick Master score. Um, kind of a steal there. Uh, for the Husky side, we have, oh, we have a line change coming. Little, little Superman Jr., I have no idea who that is. And... Catholicism rocks. Now, we know that Catholicism is probably one of the better players coming into this game on the Huskies side. And we're also getting another line change. We'll have Fred the Goose playing defenseman for APAT 8. <laughs> and in net for the Otters, I believe that is Tendi. I could be wrong. I'm gonna... I'm gonna see. Uh, yeah, Tendi 41. When's it back... Shoots it or hit passes it up the opposite side where they are. Big goal there coming in from Little Superman Jr. to tie the game up immediately after the faceoff. This is looking. I think it's gonna be a a shootout based on what I literally just seen in like fucking two seconds, dude. Oh my god. I'm surprised Gorelli is not in that as Gorelli was looking to be the top prospect. I'm not sure what happened with him. He was considered one of the top goalie prospects but uh i don't think you yeah, that that really matters much if you're a um husky because husky. you have different like two of the best goalies in the in the league two top three at least at least a pat wins it back passes it up for fred just passes it up but it just goes nowhere into the, oh and he has a chance here as he blocks it from athleticism keeping him into the corner Catholicism trying to get it out, and he does, but he gets clamped by APAT. Fred the Goose immediately applies pressure, and Little Superman takes, blocking the corner again, trying to get it out, maybe trying to get a shot on net, but isn't able to, as Little Superman Jr. finally gets out, goes on the skate, but is clamped by APAT, who is performing pretty well for, like, the few seconds that he's been on. Big block by Fred the Goose. Steal from APAT on the neutral zone. Fred the Goose taking it up for himself now, but Catalysm is there, although Fred the Goose is there to apply some pressure, gets a shot off a net, and it's in front of the net, but they cannot get it out. Luckily, the goalie shifted. Oh, big save there. That probably wouldn't have been a goal if Ape had gone to it before the goalie didn't. Lucy Man Jr. on a skate here, gets a shot off, but doesn't finish. Quake DFA with a good chance here. He does shoot, but he doesn't finish. Quake has another chance here as he has it in the neutral zone. And is going to be fighting for it alongside APAT, who hits it up. Fred the Goose gets off, and Nick Master joins back. Shot there from APAT, but it's just it's blocked by the goalie, fortunately. And it looks like APAT's going for a line change here. And I, that, uh, Trevor comes back on the ice. Quick DFA. Had a chance there, but wasn't able to, as he was clamped defensively by Nick Master. Otter's... Playing pretty good defensively if you don't consider that first goal that led in. Quick TFA against the boards. Doing absolutely everything for his team. Logical now. Has a pretty good chance here. Logical, one of the other another good player for the Huskies. This is what I mean. Huskies just have such a good team that you throw in any line and they're gonna perform. Quick TFA getting shots off on the other net. Big shot there from Trevor, and he scores. Okay. So I think we already know who's the more dominant side of these two lines, and they're immediately coming off for a line chain. Catholic and Raj for the match here. Oh, that is Zekro. 
Oh, Zekro, yeah. Zekro is personally, I think, the Otter's best player. So, lining him up against Quake TFA is probably the best thing that she can do. And if we look at stats here, I just want to see. Orlando has 41% possession, and Huskies have 59%. Interesting. Runs it backwards, but Little Superman Jr. is there to read it immediately. He gets a shot off, but it goes barely wide. Would have been a tight fit if he were to shoot that on net. Gets a pass out to Catholicism, but gets a shot off, but it's blocked by Zekro, who immediately hits it out of play, and it will be an inside face-off. Everyone crowding around. Hits it forward. Otters. Oh, Nick Master has a great chance here. Absolutely no one to contest him. Gets a shot off just a little too late. And Superman Jr. immediately coming back on the county attack. Has the chance here, and he will score her. Oh, my God. On the mistake that Nick Master did. Nick Master's mistake on whiffing the puck in the offensive zone comes back to bite him. And Little Superman Jr. tied again. This series is tied. Four goals with a minute 41 to play in the first period. And we'll be we will see a line change that might be illegal. But it not will not be called. <laughs> backwards eight pet there has a good chance to score here if he can get by catholicism which he doesn't immediately letting up pressure to let fred the goose who is our which is already the good, good call fred the goose has been performing in the offensive zone making keeping the puck inside of there which is huge when you just want to get as many shots off and you can against a team like this but this is literally what i mean big pang there by fred the goose to keep it into the offensive zone one of the Otters' better players. A very good player for the Otters. Peng away by Annoyed. Annoyed a very good goalie from what I've seen. If he if he is not better than Gorelli, then he is definitely number two. At least number three. Kobachek has a good chance here as they line change. Gets a pass out for Quake TFA, but Nick Master is there applying some sort of pressure. But Quake comes away with the puck and it is saved by Tendi. Tendi, another good goalie. I, I don't think that he's ex insane, but he's definitely as good. And Dick Mazur on a counterattack here. Takes it the full length against Quink TFA. Immediately clamps him. Has a great chance to shoot here, but Quink TFA applying his pressure. And has a good chance here, as he will go past. It gets clamped by Zekru, who gets a shot up, but it is immediately saved by Annoyed. Pass in the middle to Quake. Who has a good chance here. Gets past one. Has to get past two more. Goalie pass. Oh, what a great chance there. And immediately on the counterattack, goes wider than that. Great chance there. And we will see the end of the period. That was probably one of the best chances the Huskies had of scoring so far. That was definitely... Um, I mean, that, that that definitely should have been a goal. Seeing as how close this game is, Little Superman needed to hit that. Oh, sh <clears throat> He needed to hit that. How is this tied? What the fuck? How's your team doing? <laughs> Um, fucking, I hate waiting for this. Can they just skip? I'm going on TikTok. Okay. All right, hold on. These these might be copyright. Uh, I shouldn't do that. Okay. So guys, is like.
Okay, we're starting, guys. All right. League Master and the Catholicism, I think. Oh, Cobra Strike taking the ice for the first time. Taking face off and there's one back into the Otter Zone. Uh, Cobra Strike? Question mark? <clears throat> Has a great chance here. Isn't able to get a shot off as Tendi pokes it away. Pass it a quick, but is poked away by Nick Master, who immediately goes in the offensive. Has a great opportunity here to set some sort of play up for his team as he has Zekro playing at the blue. Quake. Oh my god. Nick Master. Absolutely dangerous. What the hell did I just watch? What the <clears throat> oh my god. <laughs> my god. Jesus Christ, dude. This... Yeah, these teams definitely deserve to be here tonight. Orlando up one. Big pass there to Cobra Strider from Cobra Catalysism. I don't even know these guys' names. It, it, we need, like, they need to be, like, white or something. Like, red. I, I cannot see these guys' names. Nick Master gets it past one. Isn't able to get past another, but still keeps possession. And now is forced himself into the offensive zone. It gets a shot off. Zekro gets a shot. Has another chance. Isn't able to, unfortunately. But he does get the shot off, and it is luckily saved. Apac coming on the ice. Catholicism almost gets the tying score, but just misses. Saved by Tendi. Tendi needs to perform now if he wants to keep this game alive. Or if he wants to just win the series. I mean, you know, you know, everybody has to do that, you know? A little bit of everything from everybody. Catholic is going on a skate here. Tendi saving the puck once again. Out of position, though, but immediately gets back into position. A little scary there. A little Superman Jr. APAT, great clamp there. Nice job. Nice job. from nice, Great pressure from APAT. Allowing him to keep it inside of the zone. Gets a shot off, but it is wide. Pass to Edmund. Edmund checking into the game for the first time. Edmund taking it all the way back into his own zone. Gets a great pass to Apat. Passes him back. Edmund, great ping. Oh, Edmund has a great chance to score here if he can get past. Oh, unfortunately, he does he does mess up his skate. But it was a great try either way. And now Logical does have a chance to score here. He doesn't. Doesn't have that chance anymore, but he still has some play to make here. Unfortunately, Apat will shut that down. Quake TFA does recover and is now into his own zone. Goes behind his net, being chased by Edmund. Has a chance to skate all the way. Edmund applying great pressure. Apat has a chance to shoot here. Gets blocked by Logical. Apat dumping it back into the zone. And Quake TFA once again recovers behind his net. Trying to allow something to happen. I, I don't know what he's trying to do. But Edmund does take away. Quick goes on the skate again. Bo, you whiffs and will have to recover inside of his own zone. He needs to get this out. And he will. He gets a pass off the logical. Who? Oh, no. Nick Master is there and clamps. Pangs the puck away. Logical needs. They need to do something about Nick. He, he, he literally is right now, for this line at least, just destroying them defensively. They, they cannot do anything against this guy. Oh. I eat my words. Little Superman has a chance here. Unfortunately, Nick Master is there again. Logical. Has a chance here to get past one. Isn't able to, but it does allow the zone to enter. Or the puck to enter the offensive zone. They're letting him sit there with the rock. Passes it down the boards. Isn't able to get past. Zekro recovers. P3 is away. Catholicism tries to make a move on Zekro, but isn't successful. Zekro with possession. 
Little Superman clamping the rock. Gets past not so much. Almost got past Nick. Catholicism has a great chance here, but unfortunately Nick Master is just so good defensively. Little Superman has a chance to shoot here, but he just misses the rock. Catholicism. Playing going back, allowing Superman to make some sort of play for himself. But he isn't able to and gets the recovery nicely. That's a shot. Oh, Nick Master scores. I this is This is looking extremely dangerous for the Huskies. As Nick Master gets his hat trick. And we could see a full change here. Wow. <laughs> I don't even know what to say. That was so disgusting. Quake TFA and Logic were checking in for the last 46 seconds of this period before we head into the final period of the game. Potentially final period of the series as the Otters have a great chance to win it all here. Quake TFA. Quake isn't able to get past Edmund who has a great chance to score here on his own. Clamped by Logical, but APAT does recover, hits it back, giving up possession immediately to Quake TFA, who gets by one, has to get by another. Great move there, I, I think. I don't even know. And it looks like Huskies aren't going to be able to score here unless Quake TFA goes on a really long skate here, but just isn't able to. Which is fine. Oh, Logical has a great chance here. He has to shoot now. Isn't able to. And that will be the period. 2-4. Orlando in the lead. Leading the series 2-1. The last period of this series or of this game. Potentially last of the series. If I'm the Otters, I literally I wanna keep my players calm because although this is like potentially series winning they have to keep cool because this t huskies team they don't let up and it seems like they're switching out annoyed for gorelli which might be a good choice here Might be a great choice here, as Annoyed is n not unreliable, just ha isn't playing like he needs to. So, Gorelli will come in, fresh out of legs. He needs to play. He needs to just make the important saves, make good saves, and not let anything stupid in. And if, if you're the skaters for the Huskies... You want to pass more. I think passing more helps a lot. Because people, they, they try to go on their own. And make their plays by on their own. And they just aren't able to get past the off, like the neutral zone. The neutral zone is where they like get shut down. Hopefully we'll see something change here. For the Huskies. So the Huskies can come back. Bring it to overtime. Win this game. And keep the series alive. And we'll hopefully go to the fifth series. If you're, the, if you're a Huskies fan. And if you're the Otters fan. You're hoping that they keep this lead up. And they don't drop a point. Maybe get another point or two. And win the series. Little Superman Jr. and APAT taking the face off. Wins. Catholicism with possession. Big clear from Zekro, and it's going to be an offside not face off near the Otters bench. Immediately taken, Little Superman has a chance to make some sort of play alongside his teammate Catholicism, who does. Big pass there, but it is too far behind. Catholicism has an opportunity here, but he just lets up a shot. Oh, ugh. And unfortunately, the clear from Catholicism lets up a goal. Although I think it is being challenged. Now the ruling that shit crossed, lol. I don't know what he's doing here.
I'm not entirely sure what he's doing. Mm. Mm. Okay. Eight pat. Gets a pass to Zekro. Gets a P3 hop. Blocked by Lewis Superman. It was a great opportunity to just score here. And he gets it by eight pat there defensively. Clears it out. Bails his goalkeeper out. Catholicism, though, has possession. Whiffs. And a pat pangs it away. Big shot. Wider than that. A pat recovers. Oh, no. It looks like Zeko's going to have a breakaway chance. But Gorelli there to save. And it will be hit out of play by a pat. And it will be by the honor or no, Huskies bench. And Huskies will go on for a line change. Annoyed and quick TFA going on the ice. One backward save by Gorelli. Big save there. Quick TFA. Opportunity to score. Clamped by APAT. Annoyed. Loses possession. Quake recovers though. Loses again. Annoyed. Oh, yeah. An, uh, Nick Master to recover. Shot there. Hits the back of the post hard. No, I'd P3s it out to quick TFA. Kind of a weak P3. I... <laughs> what the... That looked really weak. That P2 looks stronger than the P3. Big master. Great play here. Noid, great block. Noid has an opportunity here. He gets past one, gets past two, but isn't able to get past the goalie, and it goes wider than that. Quick! Oh, almost had an opportunity there. And it looks like there will be a shot taken. Nope, there will not. Quake TFA saves from his team. From a shot. Nick Master though. Nick Master, great shot there. This guy is looking like a BHLer out here, bro. What the Quake TFA. Quake Quake? Quake Um Okay. Shot there. Pengway by Gorelli. Catholicism. Trying to take it up for himself. Isn't able to. Below Superman Jr. has a chance to score here, but it's saved by Tendi and Penguin by Nick Master. Nick Master, big opportunity here. If Little Superman didn't let up his pressure, he would have had a good opportunity to score there. But fortunately, Little Superman. Oh, Nick Master ships wide of the net. Little Superman has to go past Zekro, isn't able to. Catholicism. Nick Master now with possession. Little Superman there to pressure, and he will. Penguin Bicarelli. Nick Master keeping it into the offensive zone. Two minutes left in this game, and I'm going to be honest with you guys. I think this is it for the Huskies. Oh, looks like this is going to be an offside call. Offside call. Okay. <laughs> Quick TFA. Great chance here. Has to get past A Pat. He makes a move. Zekro, that move cost him. Zekro was there to make the recovery. And Zekro keeps him in the zone. Big pass there to A Pat, who has a chance to shoot here. It just misses the rock. Saved by Gorelli. Oba strike. A pat pressuring. Isn't letting it up. Keeping it in the corner. Great kill here. Cobra strike finally gets it out, but not after at least five seconds are wasted. And every second in this period counts. Quake TFA. Has to make a play here. Needs to make a play here to keep his team alive and keep the series alive. P3 it away. A minute and seven seconds left in this period. And I didn't, like ever as every second passes, I'm starting to slowly lose hope for the Huskies. And it, with 56 seconds left in the period, it's not looking great for this Husky side. As Apen has a breakaway chance here, doesn't get the shot off, and finally gets the shot off. Quick TFA, passing it out to Cobra Strike, who's de they're desperately trying to make some sort of play. Cobra Strike taking his sweet time, Edmund clogging into the game. Cobra Strike needs to do something here. Isn't doing anything. 
and they're going to keep it in the corner with 27 seconds left in the period. I do have to say, this has been quite the game. Otters win, coming into this, arguably being the underdogs. Quick Tifa actually has a chance here, misses. Otters coming in here, being the underdogs, arguably. Winning the series, 3-1. to one. Putting this to bed, winning the JBHL regular season, and now they win the JBHL Playoff Cup, and that is game. Otters win 3-1 against all odds. Otters are your winners. Awkward because there's no music. I don't have the tank back on. I'm Papyrson. I've been your host for this game. I will see you all later. Alright, goodbye. Get me out. I'm done. Okay, where's my nitro?